Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone's having a great morning this morning and are excited about this day the Lord has blessed us with. Um, anyway, while I was working out this morning, um, I, I felt strongly in my spirit to share one of my favorite verses and one of my life verses with you. It's a very familiar passage that I think we've all heard and probably quoted and, um, and stood on. Um, as believers here, um, and it's in Romans 8:28, and it um, and it reads here: We know that God causes everything to work for the good of those who love God and are called according to His purpose. Um, well, it's a powerful, powerful passage. Let's, I want to break it down. Um, um, first off, um, this passage does not mean that everything that happens to us will be good. But rather, that God will work in and through every situation to bring good from it. And I, and I just want to share a quick story um, where this happened to me, and, it's, and I could probably spend hours on this video sharing many, many, many stories where something was not good, but God turned it into good. Um, and this happened a few months ago. Um, you might, might have remembered I did a video on it. I was in a car accident um, where someone hit me from behind and totaled the car. Um, but And I remember it was like it was yesterday. Um, immediately, I, I, I quoted this Romans 8, 28, because I, I knew something God was going to cause something good to come out of a situation that was not good. A car accident is not good. I mean, no one asked to be in a car accident, that's for sure. Um, and so immediately when I um, got out of the car, the woman who had hit me was frantic and she was crying hysterically and I tried to calm her down and um, asked her to pray for her and she said yes and we prayed, um, which brought some comfort, but she was still crying and, um, and I asked her, is there something else bothering you? And she said that her mother had cancer, so we got to pray again uh, for her mother's healing and you know it was just something that she said never she's never experienced anyone that would pray for her and um, care that much to to do so and I, I told her that you know it wasn't me obviously um, it was Jesus and I, I ended up sharing um, the gospel with her which some, no one has ever shared that with her either she had a bad taste from religion and I said well you know Jesus following Jesus is about relationship not religion so anyway the whole, the whole uh, moral of the story is that God caused something that was bad um, into something good. Um, and so, so I just want to share that with you regarding how God can use something bad and turn it into something good. Um, the second part of the verse, you know, it talks about those who love God. Um, you know, so this promise is only for those who do love God and have received Christ as their Savior and have that new perspective. And that new perspective is that, you know, that we have that faith and trust in God that we do not waver in our situations and our difficulties because we know God is with us. And that we know that He does cause, He will cause good to come out of things that aren't good. Um, and the third part of this verse that I wanted to I wanted to share with you is um, where, it, where it says, called according to His purpose. You know, God has a purpose in everything we go through. And his plans to accomplish that purpose are perfect. You know, we may not understand it. We may not see how it could be perfect. But it is perfect because God's perfect. And, and so we just need to trust God's purpose and seek to understand that he takes all the events from our life and orchestrates good from them, which leads to change perspective. And that is the key, too. We need to change our perspective when something like this happens, and that's kind of what I did in that situation. That the, you know, you know, the immediate the reaction is, "Oh, I got in a wreck, totaled my car." You know, all these negative thoughts we want to think, but I immediately changed my perspective and said, "No, God's going to change this. He's going to turn this into something good." And sure enough, He did. He used me to pray for that woman and, and share the gospel with her. So I just want to encourage you with this passage to next time something comes up and it will believe me in this in this journey we're on in life the evil that's in the world the, the sin that's in the world there's going to be bad things that happen to us um, and I want you to change your perspective when that happens 
look for something good to come out of it. Again, not that that is good that happened, but God can and will cause it to turn into something good. And it's for His purpose. So I hope, um, I hope this ministers to you. I um, hope it encourages you. Um, and I hope you have an amazing day with many blessings from the Lord. Know that I am praying for you and I love you guys.